Hey folks, it's October, so that means it's time for Keep September Release Report? First, let's take a look at last month's releases. Ooh, ah, oh that's great. Wow, look at that one. <laughs> we had ourselves a good old fashioned hackathon, which means we took your direct suggestions and used them to make Infusionsoft and Keep even better. So let's take a look at everything you helped us build. Hey everyone, Grady here and Rahel wasn't messing around. September was our hackathon. Basically what a hackathon is is that we spend two full days going through all of the feedback you've been giving us on our product and we start making little cool awesome fixes. So what's in store for this month? When you add a merge field for a social media account, the merge field now properly links to the social media account for the owner of that contact. Now you can set delay timers to only count weekdays between actions. If you use a lot of web forms spread out across your vast interconnected network of campaigns, you can now see all your web forms in one place and see what campaigns they're in. No more blindly clicking through your campaigns. Now on the back end, we did a database cleanup that's sure to make your app run smoother and your campaigns load quicker. If you're using a merchant with multiple accounts, you can now see the merchant ID on reports and setup pages. This is real helpful if you switch between merchants or use our API. Keep an eye out for more upgrades from this hackathon and future hackathons month after month. Relative dates added to reports. Now you can set specific time periods in addition to date ranges on your reports. No more complicated workarounds and constantly updating saved reports. Here in my e-commerce reports, if I go down to all sales report, and now I see all my reports. But if I want to be more specific, I can go to edit criteria, and I can choose not only date ranges, but now I can choose intervals. And I can look at all of my sales in the past 30 days. And this report will automatically update, so it's always a rolling 30 days. UI updates. We're hard at work adding design and user interface updates to Infusionsoft. This month we focused on two areas, contact view and the My Day dashboard. Both are now cleaner and more user friendly than ever before. The best part, they're now completely mobile responsive. All right, Keep users, you've been patient long enough. Contact record chronology review. To really drive the point home that we listened to your feedback, a little while ago we made an update to Keep and decided to remove the contact record chronology view, which led to a large number of you saying, hey, I was using that. So we put it back. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Email marketability status. Now you can see the email marketability status of your contacts right on the contact record. And you can move unengaged contacts into a re-engagement campaign. New B2B functionality. We know a lot of you are working with more than just individual contacts. You're working with entire companies. And now we have tools that allow you to manage those companies. See existing companies and attach them when adding new contacts. See existing contacts now when filtering easily edit and delete company names. And finally, you can now search and view contacts by company name. Well, that wraps up the September release report. Another hackathon in the books, lots of updates, and we have Keeps Icon 2020 event around the corner. Don't wait any longer. We've got a weeks long convention packed into a single virtual weekend. Our Keep an Entrepreneur focused interactive virtual event will be from November 12th to November 14th, 2020, and will offer session after session of dynamic speakers, hands-on workshops, and networking opportunities beyond what even a pre-COVID convention could match. So follow the link in the description to the icon registration page and finish 2020 stronger than you started in. Oh yeah, this month's fun fact. Eddie Murphy's iconic Beverly Hills Cop was originally turned down by none other than Sylvester Stallone. Good call for everyone involved. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next month. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. Kay.